Hey guys, what is up? My name is Kay. Now today we're going to be taking a look at the Windows Surface Pro 1 from Microsoft. Now I'd like to thank MobyC for sending this product out for review. There will be a link in the description box below to where you can have a look at this site. Now this tablet here is basically a laptop touchscreen running Windows 8. So let's have a look around the device. Obviously at the front we have the 10.81 inch screen. We have a camera up the top which is 1.2 megapixels. Now down the bottom here we have a Windows touch sensitive button which brings up the Metro on the back. Now on the back here we have a few connections which you can't really see because it's kind of dark even though I did have some lights up. Now we have a USB port, just down USB 2.0, volume switch and a headphone jack. Now on the bottom we have um, the connection for the keyboard which I didn't actually receive. You have to actually buy that separate if you want to buy that for the tablet. Now on this side here we have a connection for the pen which I didn't actually get to use in this video. I totally forgot about it. So there will be a link in the description box below to a video where they demonstrate the pen. Now on the back we have a kickstand and we also have a camera which I didn't actually see until editing this video but the camera is a 1.2 megapixel camera same one as on the front now when I first got this tablet I thought oh wow this is going to be great a touch screen laptop that I can use and test out now when I first used it the first time I thought wow okay this is not what I expected I was expecting an experience like an iPad I guess but I was totally wrong. This tablet is definitely great if you're, I could say, like business people and you want to use like Word, PowerPoint, all that sort of stuff. But for everyday user who just going to go buy this and use it in the home, I personally couldn't suggest it to you for that reason. Um, it's just not that great. Like I mean, I'll show you in a minute one of the features using the keyboard. Like you have to click up the top to open the keyboard, and then it doesn't open you have to actually manually go down the bottom and press the keyboard button and then click again to remove the address and backspace and type the address again but that's not it once you actually do that you've actually got to close the keyboard manually which I kind of find really annoying because it's like a three-step process so hopefully they do fix that in the Surface Pro 2 or the Windows 8.1 update that should be coming out soon now the specs of this tablet are, it's got a NVIDIA Tegra 3 with a 1300MHz quad-core process in it. Now this model is the 64GB version with 2GB of RAM and a 10.6 inch display as I spoke about before. Anyway guys, that's it for this review of the Windows Surface Pro. If you want to get pick up one of these, there's a link in the description box below to where you can pick one up from Moby City. Now, anyway guys, I'd like to thank you for watching this video and I do have a special announcement to make. Um, this will be my last video for quite some time. I'm just going to be taking a short break. I'm not too sure when we're coming back to make more content but I'm not going anywhere. I will definitely be back so I'll see you when I upload a new video. Anyway guys, if you want to stay up to date with all my new content I'm going to be putting out on Facebook, um, the link in the description box below to where you can find my Facebook page. I'll probably post on there when I'm going to post something else up. So anyway guys, um, thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.